Hello everyone and welcome back to SimCity and welcome back to Iron Mountain City, my first Academy City in my Omega Curve vs. Academy region, where both quote unquote factions fight for control of three islands and where I'd like to evolve present cities into the future with the help of the Academy and Omega Co. And yeah, <laughs> I have a bunch of problems here in the city. As you may remember, uh, the nuclear power plant was unsafe to use because I had a lot of not enrolled students. And yeah, <laughs> right after loading this city, I've got the message nuclear meltdown imminent. <laughs> so I instantly closed the nuclear power plant and I think it was fast enough because it's still there. And we just have uh, some slightly radiation. Um, where it is? Where's the radiation map over there. So yeah, I think this is okay. <laughs> we can deal with this. Um, yeah, but now the city is out of power and I already added a oil power plant over here. It should produce enough power, but it's still hiring. So no power production at the moment here in the city. And so hopefully this will online pretty soon. Um, yeah, otherwise we will have some big issues here in the city. All right. Uh, yeah, education. As you can see, I have uh, not enrolled students. No, we don't have any any not enrolled students anymore. As you can see, this is very good. And yeah, so probably this will help us now. Uh, I think the school capacity was not high enough. That's the reason why I had so many not enrolled students. And yeah, actually I could add a community college or so, but I want to keep everything low tech, my industry. Uh, I want to keep my industry low tech. And so I don't want to add this community college. And I'm pretty sure it, it should work without this because uh, the whole time this worked or this uh, nuclear power plant was safe to use, the education level was high enough, without any university or community college. So I think when all students are enrolled and educated again, I shouldn't have any problems anymore. So, but for so long, I will use the oil power plant. Oh, it's online. And produce power and it was fast fast enough no one really noticed <laughs> that um, that the nuclear power plant was about to explode so it's our little secret so <laughs> uh, I don't want to um, concern the population over here in the city um, all right there are a couple of other things we have to do here in the city. And yeah, in my academy city, I researched a lot of things and unlocked a lot of things. For example, we can start to build the sky bridge levels here in or at the mega towers. I'd like to build the first sky bridge level here. I'd like to build them at level six. And for the sky bridge level, we need a control net. So in this case, Omega Co needs Academy. And one thing I ask myself is I could probably import control net, but it's not available. I'm exporting control net in Ocean City, definitely. It's activated there, but it's not available. I'm not sure if it is because I need to have 
the city in the same quad like my academy city or is it because at the moment there is nothing that needs control net in the city probably let's see um, if we are not able to import control net I will add a what is it called control net facility here in the city I think somewhere over here close to my high walls population and they are closed over here no shoppers hmm. I think yeah I will add some more uh, high walls uh, residential zones we will definitely have enough shoppers again. All right. So, yeah, it should add another road. Uh, is there enough space? Hello, guidelines. Why you only snap this road? Probably you could snap this road as well. No, for some reason. It doesn't seem to work. Ah, there is something. Uh, hopefully, uh, or is it because there's not enough space between them? I can't say. Let's use, or let's better use the the old park trick to measure things here. All right. Yeah, there should be enough space on the side. Definitely. Maybe on this side it's a bit... No, there should be also enough space so we can... Uh, build residential zones or res residential homes, houses on both sides. And there should be enough space. And I need to rise the land value. And I need to futurize this area so probably is a good idea to build a water tower over here. Mm, yeah, probably it is. And let's futurize this area. Uh, especially this one close to my industry zones. We should build some plazas to increase the land value and I think this was not enough we need a bit more whoa what was this uh, I think for the moment there was a high rise or so <laughs> um maybe where is it Maybe this one fits a bit better somewhere. Hmm. Yeah, maybe let's try something like this. All right. Yeah, this should rise the land value, so we will have some more uh, high wealth workers here in the city. All right. So this was that and now the sky bridge level is finished and we have no control net and now I'm curious if yeah, it's because of this if we are able to import control net right now no Iron Mountain is out of control net by control net from Ocean City to turn your Academy tag on. Ah, I think I have to. No control net to this city. I am confused. No control net to this city. Select another city to buy control net. Is it because it is too far enough? <laughs> it is too far or not close enough? I'm not sure. Apparently, it is not working. Hmm. 
So I think, yeah, it, it, I have to, to check this. I'm not sure about this. Or do you know what is about this? Is it necessary to have a control net city in the same quad like a city? So, however, I'm going to add a control net facility simply here. So probably we can do or we can add this over here. All right, now everything futurize here. And let's upgrade this road. I think we can upgrade this to high density. All right. And yeah. We will not have so many high wealth workers here in the city, so we will not provide so much control net for the city. I'm quite cur curious how much we are able to provide and why we do not have any buildings anymore over here. I think there should be enough space. Yeah, but however, let's add some more of them. I, I just want to have uh, low density houses over here. So some kind of suburban area. Or maybe I should build some kind of high, medium density center. So we will have more available control net. Maybe I should do this. Can we do something like this? Probably. All right. We have some health issues. So where's the clinic? It's over there near capacity. So I think it's a good idea to build the hospital in the city. Because yeah, the, the clinic is uh, out of ca capacity. Here we have the police, the fire station. Is there enough space for the hospital? No, it isn't. So where we can build this? Probably, probably over here. I mean, this is a, a my old suburban area. So, yeah, but I think it's okay if we do this here because uh, we want to evolve the city. And so, what could we add? Hmm. I think this is a good idea to add the wellness center. Yeah, this is nice. Uh, what if the patient's capacity, treatment capacity, 40. Uh, okay, this for the moment, this should be enough. Um, This is a good idea to do this. Put this over here. And mm. so faster injury healing. It sounds also very well. <laughs> Let's build this over there. And yeah, as you may notice, I haven't played around with the hospital so much so far. That's the reason why I read myself through everything. Let's add the sign over here. So we have additional ambulances. And let's see. I think this will help us. Um, I think we can slowly remove patient rooms from this clinic and it's still unsafe. I, 
Yeah, it's unfortunately. So I will I will wait this whole episode and if this will not work, then I think I have to build the community college or so. What does the public library helps? I'm I'm actually I I'm not really sure what it exactly do, but yeah, however, let's let's build it. I mean we have nothing to lose. Let's add it over there. All right. Um. Yeah. What was I saying? Control net. We still do not produce enough control net because we do not have so many uh, high walls workers in the city. So yeah, I I have no chance. I definitely need to upgrade this road's density to have medium density high world workers here in the city. Yeah, I, I have to do this. Uh, which side I should upgrade? I think I can probably upgrade this to medium density. But yeah, there we go. Now we have a medium density high world worker home soon here. So what will happen if I add residential zones over here? There's some a commercial zone left, <laughs> a tiny one. So I don't know. Wait a second. I want to. All right. Yeah. What I want to do is maybe here is enough space for a small density. I will work a house. Still not enough control net. Yes. Yeah, that's a bit sad that we cannot import control net from the city. So, yeah, however, we need to expand our maggot house now. We need more low wells workers. And. Oh, sorry, my telephone. All right, I'm back. <laughs> sorry. Um, yeah, what was I saying? Yeah, we need more low wells workers. So let's add another apartment level. And yeah, it would have been probably a better idea to have another academy city over there. But yeah, I wanted to have a Omega Co Island. By the way, what they are complaining about. Yeah, it's because of the not not enough control net situation. All right. And I also have a lot of available jobs for medium wells workers. And here I have my office tower. Hmm. Yeah, probably we can add another low wells apartment level to this one. Oh, we have only low wells levels. <laughs> so yeah, let's build a medium wells level. top of this and yes yeah, slowly it fills up with workers and yeah we we have a bit of control net 
transmitting right now, but probably not enough for every sky bridge. So cool. It's enough for the city, so I think we are good with this. Uh, if necessary, we could build another one. The monthly costs are not so high. So yeah, probably this is a good idea. I think I should optimize things here a bit later. All right, so Skybridge level. And here we have level five, so we can add another Skybridge level. So this is Skybridge Station. Doesn't need so much control net anyway. All right. And yeah, actually, I think I could add workers here or lower workers as well because I don't need so much other things over here. I'm pretty sure I don't need another more level or other service things. My waste capacity in the city is quite well. So yeah, let's add another apartment level because we need a whole bunch of workers and probably we will have a lot of um, unenrolled students right now. It's still unsafe. I think this will not work. <sighs> Sadly. All right, and why you are complaining about something? The Omega Co. HQ is prepared to upgrade. Upgrading is necessary to add new divisions. So yeah, let's upgrade the Omega Co. HQ. And what we should build first. I'm not sure if we should build the robotics division because then <coughs> we are able to produce drones. Or should I build the commerce division so we are we unlock we are unlocking the uh, VTUL pad, which is also very interesting. I think I I gonna start with the robotics division, and yeah, let's put this over here. I don't want to have any residential buildings here anyway. All right, like this. And now let's dezone this here. All right, all right. Dezone, dezone. Let's remove all this stuff. So later I could build a plaza or something like this over there. All right, so. Yeah, we are producing a lot of Omega, a lot of crates. We still not, still have not reached, reached the capacity limit. And someone, I've forgotten his name, sorry, asked me in the, in the comments if I also have problems that I do not reach the capacity limit. And I, s I answered that I think, uh, or I, I, I had this problem and I, I said I think it is because uh, I had two less factories. And I think this was the case because in the meantime I added a lot of additional factories. And now uh, we are much closer to the capacity limit. And if I check the Omega, you can see now we have almost every industrial building is uh, Omega franchise industry building and one of the things that is weird is that no uh, residential no residents uh, purchase Omega not so many so let's let's put these drones this will probably help us um, so 
sorry. <laughs> I was right there. Yeah, I want to build another Omega factory over here. And, okay, I have to put this there because it, I need to expand production lines in this direction. So let's remove this Omega production line and let's build the drone assembly line instead. I'm not sure. Uh, does the drone assembly line needs the same uh, space? Yeah, I think it's doesn't need any uh, not more space than the Omega production line. So there should be still enough space to add additional assembly lines or so. Let's see. All right. Now we can build drones, but for drones we need processors. And processors needs to be imported. So here we import raw ore and crude oil. Also over here, but we have this freight shipping warehouse. Um, I think we don't need this one anyway, so we can probably remove this and build the processor storage lot instead and import processors. Import, okay. And that's, I think there are enough trucks, so yeah, when we got our first processor shipment the Omega Co factory will start to produce drones and these drones will work for residents as shopping drones so these drones will go to the shopping center will buy Omega for our residents and will carry the Omega right to their homes and then the homes the houses will, or the, the residents will get Omega Gold subscribers. That means a lot of additional profit for us. This is all we need to know. Alright. Um, upgrade road to increase density. I think this is probably a good idea. High density. High density. Oh, there. Uh, hopefully this will work. I'm not sure about this. If we have enough space over here and there's some weird intersection. Okay, because there's this futurization thing. So if we add this here somewhere. Mm, uh, we have no, not enough space. So, yeah. I'm not sure if this one can up great itself to high density you now all right and yeah probably we still need more industry uh, let's see what we can do over here we need omega what's your problem my friends so i think one thing we could do is to increase High density to increase the density over here so we will probably have high density factories here in a few moments so and is there anywhere else space for industry probably here yeah we still need more industry buildings definitely So yeah, here we we have our drones. As you can see, they are flying around in the city. Uh, where where he is? Oh, he's gone. So maybe we can see another drone launching. 
there we go. <laughs> Have you seen it? Uh, however, yeah, these drones will now start to buy Omega for our residents. And we can also add um, these type of buildings. Uh, drone hangers to our service buildings like fire station police and hospital and yeah they will help a lot in yeah providing health service uh, fire you know yeah to provide all these services <laughs> to your inhabitants yeah sorry i'm a bit confused today in this episode I, I don't know i think it's because i have so many problems here in this city that's it's really stressful ah this one is upgrading Whew, very nice good news it's done safe so yeah i think i have no other chance but if i add the community college i would need a lot more medium well, it's workers. This, this is not very good because I think then I had to or have to change my mega towers. So let's add this one. I'm curious, uh, or is it really the case that the nuclear power plant? Did do not work with just grade schools and high schools in your city. I mean, it, it worked for 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 I don't know for, for hours, and then my education level drops, and then it didn't work anymore. So I'm curious. I think I have to to figure this out before I build anything like the community college. All right, let's speed up the simulation because we want to build the sky bridge connection and we, we could build our first crown. What we could do? Uh, no, there's still one level left. All right, we could also build the safety level. And yeah, this will also convert drones into law drones or fire drones. And yeah, but I think we still we still need our service building anyway, so let's let's keep it like it is. And let's build the so we could probably well maybe we can build or we should build the waste reduction level. But this needs control net. How much control net? 2,500. That's not good. We not have so much control net. Um, so yeah, let's let's simply keep it with apartment. No wells. And then we could, could build a crown. And the only... Yeah, maybe we could build the... The uh, safety level here. I think... Yeah, I know I said I don't think we really need this, but uh, it makes sense because this is a service tower. So just because it's a service tower, let's build the safety level. And it doesn't need any control net, <laughs> which is good for us. All right. Oh, we have a lot of traffic down here. So... Yeah, we could think about to add a maglev network, but this also would need we know we would mean we need additional control net. So probably my suburban area here will not work. <laughs> All right. Okay, we have the sky bridge level. Yeah, and, and of course we could connect both sky bridge levels now. Uh, 
yeah, this one and that one. Later I could build a connection from here to this tower and to this tower. And yeah, I think finally in the end this will look really cool with the Omega Co, Omega Co HQ between these huge towers. And let's build another apartment level, I think. Yes, we still need a lot of low wealth workers here. A lot. <laughs> so here we can build the crown. And Oh, this is also interesting. This produce power, but it doesn't need to control net. Hmm. This is also cool. The Cyclops coaster crown. Um, but I'm not sure. I mean, we don't do not really need a tourism crown. But it will would help us with the tourism crown in my academy city because it will uh, rise the effect. So I think we should simply start with the with a park crown, something simple. All right, so that's it, and. Yeah, I think on this mega tower we can also build a crown and then this episode is uh, by far long enough again. So yeah, need to wait a couple of minutes and let's check the Omega Co state. We still not sell anything to residentials, uh, to my residents, which is interesting. And, and yeah, some factories need Omega, apparently, this one. And yeah, now they are very unhappy of this hmm all right so maybe it is now a good idea to add additional Omega production lines to this one probably because we now need a lot more for industry. I think it's because this one is now a high uh, high density industry building. Still need workers. All right, there we are and let's build. Uh, what could we build here? So yeah, probably simply another park crown because this will make the residents pretty happy. And by the way, let's let's check the education situation. Oh, what is with our water? Actually, it's good, but some for some reason. Hmm. What is the problem? The ground under one of your pumps is drying out. Yeah, this is a big problem here in the city, but uh, for most pumps, I think it's okay. And the other ones, I need to futurize the area. So let's simply ignore this. And what was I saying? Education. Yeah, the education level is rising again. And yeah, it's still unsafe. What will happen if I switch this on. I mean, is it just because I turn it off and no workers are there anymore? So that's probably the reason why it's still unsafe. It could be this the case. 
<sighs> Should I do this? Should I turn this on? Guys, what do you think? Yeah, let's do this. Let's do this. I'm a bit concerned about this. But let's see. Uh, maybe when we... Ha the new uh, employments are educated enough, so then it will be safe again. Let's see. If not, I will turn it off again. And now I could add the uh, nuclear... No, low-skilled workers. Melt down a minute. So let's turn it off again. Yeah, what was I saying? Yeah, and now I could add the nuclear power plant level to one of my mega towers. Because this one is always safe to use, but actually this nuclear power plant over here with its uh, white clouds look pretty awesome here in my industry city. So that's the reason why I want to keep this, if it is possible. But I think probably I have to change, change, change my plans. And yeah. But I think for this episode, we are done. Um, and yeah, still a couple of problems we have to solve, but I think generally we are done now. And um, but actually there's not so much to do anymore. Uh, I still need to put some work in this new residential area I recreated but yeah almost my mega towers are almost finished here as well I wish I can produce or have enough profit of Omega to fully upgrade the Omega HQ but yeah we will see so thank you very much for watching and Sorry for this little confusing episode and goodbye.